Hello, my beautiful Vibe Drivers. Welcome to your Mystic Affirmations for Thursday, December the 7th of 2023. Many blessings to you all. Remember, this is our collective energy for all sun, moon, and rising signs. That means if you'd like to have a personal reading, please visit my website, royalmystic.com. I'll be more than happy to assist you once you schedule your appointment. You'll also find all the information on the retreat in January for the Key West activation with Royal Mystic. If you'd like to, to ask me any questions about that, please email me at royalmystictarot at gmail.com and I'll be more than happy to answer all the things that you may want to know that aren't on there if you have any special requests. So we're going to start off with the energy of the Seven of Pentacles and the Seven of Cups. Double sevens. So we had some some major sevens. I believe it was day before yesterday. It might have even been yesterday's. Uh, so the sevens prevail again. So here's the energy of the fruit ripening on the vine and the energy of the dump truck load of blessings. You know, that's, <laughs> that's the seven of cups energy. It means it's going to come in at you like a heap and you're going to have to work through it systematically and not try to scoop it all up and do it all at once because that will overwhelm you. So keep the nurturing energy going by using your uh, right decisions here to allow this abundance to grow and move in the energy of one step at a time systematically to accomplish the dump truck load. So let's see what else we have, my darlings. Thank you, angels, archangels, divine, pure white light. Divine Spirit. Oh, we have the Magician with the Seven of Cups. The Magician is the Master Manifestor energy. And this is the energy where we focus with intention. It's usually involving meditation. And you're in that energy moving things in your path to create the outcome you want to have. In other words, seeing yourself as already achieving it. And when you're in the energy of the limitless abundance of the universe, all things are possible. So it's your focus that matters. You are the one who has the power over that. Divine Spirit, Spirit Guides, Gods and Goddesses, thank you so much for being present here to allow all sun, moon, and rising signs to have the information they seek to assist them in remaining on their highest possible spiritual path. We thank you, Divine, for these blessings and beautiful messages, and we receive them in the love and light for which they are intended. We thank you for this divine guidance as always, and we welcome your blessed energy. Thank you so much, divine. You are always welcome and very appreciated. So you know the middle card is going to be the two of pentacles, but there's a card underneath it. So we've got our one, our two, and I'm going to, yeah, that's good. And our three. Y'all know I've got a new light as well. I've got a whole new little setup. The only thing that hadn't changed is the cards and the, and the crystals and cloths. <laughs> But I'm doing things, having all kinds of new. I told y'all I was going to be changing things up. So here we have the beautiful hanged woman. And this is the energy of meditation. Seriously, this is what this card is about, is being focused in your higher mind. Allow yourself to connect to source and higher self, and you will be shown the bigger picture. That's the whole way it works. It is true. That's how I ended up in doing the med the uh, event in Key West because I came out of a meditation and they said, call and check that out and see if you can get it. And hello, <laughs> it's happening. We have the support energy. Thankfully, I have support with all of that. All of my wonderful vibe tribers, I thank you all. And support is an, is an integral part of you stepping out of your comfort zone and being able to move in places you've never moved before. So this one says, I surround myself with supportive people who believe in my dreams. And quite a few of you have reached out to me in the comments and even private emails where you have told me so personally. So thank you for all the support, my darlings. I do love you and I appreciate every ounce of it because I am stepping out of my comfort zone. And uh, here we go. I mean, it's happening. It is happening and it must happen. It is this, it's time. So I have made peace with my little inner insecurity and we are going for it and remaining flexible. I am flexible, adaptable to change while I pursue my ambitions. In other words, don't get so rigid on how you think it should show up. Um, that was one of the things I had to overcome. <laughs> uh, you just have to understand. And, and those are sneaky things. 
they come at you in a, in a very uh, under, under the radar kind of way. And you don't even realize you're doing it. The resistance of how you think it should show up, right? So I'll stay flexible. Thankfully, I'm doing my meditations like a fiend. And that is helping me to see these things. Remain positive. Absolutely. We love this card. It's a beautiful energy. A very solid celebration. And there's all that magic being thrown out there. So we love that. The magician is at work with the positivity. There's no sense in, in getting upset about anything. It's, it's going to work out the way it's going to work out for every one of us. So positive. You might as well be happy while you get there. Right? Universal love. We love this energy because this is our connection to the all, to the oneness of all creation. This is where we get our empathy and our connection to others and allow ourselves to have compassion. The frequency of universal love attracts the connection that we feel to each other, to our planet, and to the whole of existence itself. This is that energy of being super happy just to exist and be alive and for all the wonderful things that we have benefited from in this 3D realm, in this physical form. It's all about that, you know. We're having an experience that we need for our, for our growth. And we have Jewel. Every event in life presents us with a new opportunity to experience ever greater love. There is a jewel to be found within every teardrop. Trust. We, your angels, are guiding the current events. It is time and, oh, sorry. This is a time in which you and those close to you will emerge strengthened by ever greater bonds of love. Trust. There is nothing to fear. There is only love. And you've got the universal love right there. So let's see what we've got again. Action. Ready, set, action. Drop all fear and just do it. Exclamation point. That's my phrase of the day. <laughs> you have the power to create and be whatever you truly want. Look inside your heart and take positive action in those things that bring you closer to achieving your desired goals. Nothing can stop you except your own fears. This card is positive confirmation from God and the angels that the time is right for you to start a new and exciting venture. Well, here we go. Here we go, y'all. Absolutely. And... There's the card that was underneath that two of pentacles. It's the ace of pentacles. So this is a gift from divine and it's the energy of being very solidly planted in the new beginning as you are in your financial stability. So wonderful energy of a gift of that new platform coming in, which means a new resource. And it can be a completely new resource in addition to what you're doing or just a whole new, whole new shift into a whole new direction. And you go from the one to the two and one, two, three. <laughs> and so here's the two of pentacles, which is the energy of the infinity symbol. As you see, it's telling you stay in the flow and don't let yourself be um, distracted by anything good, bad, or indifferent that's going to take your eye off the prize because you don't want to have to reset yourself and start again if you drop this, right? Another ace. The Ace of Cups, this is the gift of divine, beautiful, holy acceptance and approval of what you're doing because this Ace is the Holy Grail energy and inside it is the elixir of life. It's a gift saying no matter what you want, everything you need is here. The DNA of it exists in this cup and you can create it through your vibrational frequency of belief and bring it into this realm. So... When you get this kind of energy, this is telling you anything's possible. Absolutely anything. Things that you don't even know are possible. So that is the miraculous energy. Get your meditation and your focus. Keep your eye on the prize. Feel the support from the people who love you. Allow yourself to take action when it's time and remain positive. It's very simple. <laughs> Sounds really simple, doesn't it? We all know it ain't so simple. I send you lots of love and light. Many blessings to you all. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you tomorrow. Namaste, my friends.